Welcome back. We continue our track on the freezing rain and sleet in our area, making for dangerous road conditions. Lauren, we were talking about South Jersey really getting the brunt of the freezing rain right now. Absolutely. They're closest to the most moisture and the most energy, Joe. So we've seen this steady, light, freezing rain for out a good chunk of the day, and it is starting to accumulate. So you really want to be careful for those icy conditions, especially on the road. Storm Scan 3 showing us to the north and west, kind of left out of this. A few passing snow showers, but our primary precipitation type has been. That freezing rain and drizzle, also with some sleet mixing in, where you see the purple areas, a couple of snowflakes trying to mix in as well. But across South Jersey, encased in that pink temperatures right now, showing us we're getting the rain to fall and our temperatures are sub freezing, so it is sticking right to the surface, creating those icy conditions. We do have a bit of a breeze, but wind speeds up there around 13, 14 miles per hour. The good news is we're not going to have intense, strong, gusty winds because strong, gusty winds. In combination with ice, can take down tree limbs and lines, power outages. So, we could still see with some ice accumulation some power outages, especially with that kind of marginal breeze, but it could be much, much worse if we had the stronger, gustier winds. But do watch out for tricky travel throughout the overnight period as we'll continue to see these areas of freezing rain and drizzle, as well as some sleet. Our temperature tonight down to 26 degrees. And then for our day tomorrow, much quieter, cold, cloudy conditions. 38 degrees are high temperature, running below average once again. But this isn't going to be the first. We have a couple of systems that are going to be moving through, returning late day on President's Day. Some light freezing rain and sleet that picks up as we head into Monday night. Tuesday morning could be just a mess with freezing rain, wintry mix, some heavy at times, even rumbles of thunder. And then on Thursday and Friday, another chance for a wintry mix rest transitioning over to rain. So it Looks like it could be a tough and certainly cold week ahead with high temperatures not in again in the 40s until next Friday. We'll be right back.